isn't the only game in town. Fashion Month continued in fashion capitals Paris and Milan. Donatella Versace made the biggest news of the century. Okay, okay, the season. Reuniting supermodels Carla Bruni, Claudia Schiffer, Naomi Campbell, Cindy Crawford, and Helena Christensen for a tribute to the late, great Gianni Versace. No show in Europe is more fun than Moschino, which hosted a slew of the next gen of super mods, including Gigi Hadid, Bella Hadid, Kaya Gerber, Taylor Hill, and My Little Pony's triumphant return to the catwalk. Nobody does a fashion show quite like Chanel. And once again, Karl Lagerfeld ruled the runway in another subtle and intimate show. <laughs> or something like that. There was a line down the block to catch Cynthia Rowley's presentation at her West Village headquarters. The designer gave the runway a break and had the models stand on huge swings. What was Rowley's inspiration? This season I was thinking about how can you incorporate swimwear into New York City life. Actually, Cynthia, we know you have nothing to worry about right now, so let's play a game. It's Word Association with Cynthia Rowley. What comes to your mind when you hear the word Madonna? Virgin. San Francisco. Surfing. Fashion. Um, oh my god, this is too hard. This is too hard. Fashion week. Fashion stress. Fashion happy. Fa happy. Happiness. <laughs> beer. Oh, yum. I love beer. Surfing. Um, more surfing? More, please? <laughs> Backstage, Cynthia and her longtime hair collaborator, Richard Cavanaugh, filled us in on the look. To me, I wanted the girls to look like, see, you know, goddesses coming to life. And so the hair is kind of like wild and wavy and meant to look, you know, sort of goddess-like. Um, and Redkin has done a great job with the hair. Our job as hair directors is, you know, we have to make sure that people are looking at the girl. They're looking at the clothes. They want to be that girl, or they want to have that girl over for dinner, or they just, I, I want that dress because I want to be like her. And I feel like hair always should be like music. Each season, it should be somehow familiar, but something new at the same time. And, you know, mixing and matching genres to create something that feels familiar, 